Well, look at that load. That is a strange looking load, isn't it? Especially when you get right up here and you look under and you go, where's the beef? There ain't nothing in there. <laughs> well, I tell you what, I'll explain it all to you right here on Pops Mother Road Flatbed Report. everybody it has uh, been a uh, interesting week as we have gone uh, all the way into uh, Illinois We've gone on the west side of Chicago and uh, made six drops over at Chicago land and uh, got a, a load coming uh, back I want to show you here it's kind of an interesting load <clears throat> take a look at this what do you think about that well this up here is just a stack of uh, four by four uh, block or planks and you put them up there it's called a bulkhead um, and you got a chain over the top of this and you bu bungee it to no, bungee it you boom bang it together right up here with some boomer with a boomer and it makes a nice solid wall and i tell you that only to show you that it's kind of a heavy deal here and kind of wondering what the heck this load is right what is this load pretty big well, let's take a little peek under the skirt here just a little bit and give you a look what's that look like well there's the load up there there's a load looking towards the back what do you think that is <laughs> Well, let's take another look at it as we uh, move ourselves to the back here. I will tell you that uh, the total weight of what we have on here, uh, we put on about 45,000 pounds worth of it. Take a look at this back in here now. I will almost never leave the tail end like this, but because of what, how we've got this loaded in here, I didn't have any choice on this back end but to just kind of pull it down here and bungee it together this wacky way like this but this will kind of give you give you a clue of what we got in here if we take a look under here looky here now if i look up it's going to give it away there's what's going on look at this this is tubular steel pipe that we make implements with some heavy duty stuff and I have 46, uh, excuse me, 45 to 46,000 pounds of it. And these are called risers or levelers, whatever you want. A little piece of wood on top of it is called a dunnage uh, truck driver. It's just a four by four plank. And then you put those bundles and you can see the individual bundles there. There's one over there, two, three, four, five, I think might be a sixth one over there but there's they're three high and so with all that steel on there it makes a pretty sizable load what's deceptive about it is that you look here at this at this uh, side and this right here there's nothing in there <laughs> it's it's empty from here to here and then we have about three foot on the top that makes up the rest of the uh, the load and we tarp it all the way up here to the front you want to see underneath here real quick see the other side now if I back up right here you can see 
that that is only about three foot high so it's three foot high all the way to the back there and this part underneath here is just all air and so this is laying flat on this deck up here and we put those levelers about right there and right there in between the axles and that makes uh, for the load to be distributed even and we wind up being able to scale this thing out with 45,000 pounds worth of steel and this bulkhead up here is just in case anything slips it'll hit that and it won't come up here and go zappo right there into the cab where me and Justin have been sitting right there. Well, that's just about it for this week, guys. Hope you enjoyed a little explanation on this uh, little load that we got out of uh, central, north central Illinois, taking it back to central Kansas. And uh, guys, I hope you have a good weekend. And uh, I'm gonna take a couple of days off, I'm taking four days off, and I'll be back next week and I'll update you then. Have a great one. Thanks for joining us here on Pop's Mother Road Flatbed Report.